Hello you guys, welcome back to another episode of Cyber Attack Talk where I give you all the tea on who has been attacked. First, let me say sorry for the long wait. Sorry, 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 sorry. Um, I had a lot going on behind the scenes. I had to go out of town um, for one of my sister school functions um, last week. Wait, is it last? No, the, two weeks ago. And last week when I got back in town, I got really, really sick. And I didn't have the motivation to get up and do anything. So now I am getting my life back together. And I am trying to get back into the routine of things. And I've also started working. So I'm going to be doing these uh, videos probably after work. Um, just so I can keep myself motivated and in the loop all right so that's that so um any newcomers welcome welcome um feel free to reach out below comment on any of the articles um i just give like a basic um overview of what is going on with these different companies and you can do the research i'll link the um the articles in the comments in the description boxes so if you want to discuss it you know feel free if you have any updates or have been part of these attacks you know tell us your experience below right all right so today i got my notes over here because i just did that last night so i'm going to be referring to this um to these so today we are talking about and I'm hoping I'm not butchering this. Augusta. Augusta, Georgia. Okay. Um, the city. The city, Augusta. So, according to the article, um, there's a group called Black Bite. Um, they have claimed responsibility of a ransomware attack on the city of Augusta. They have posted about 10 gigabytes of data for free and say they have a lot more in store if they don't get what they're asking for. They said that um, the city has started um, experiencing technical difficulties on May 21st, 2023, um, due to unauthorized access to the systems. Um, once everything was analyzed, they said they found data leak, which was payroll, contact information, uh, PII, which is personal identifi identifiable information, physical addresses, contacts, and the city budget. Now, BlackBite is a Russian-based ransomware service um, game that targets corporate victims worldwide um it says that it started in july of 2021 so anything dealing with ransomware we know that is for financial gain they said that the um, according to the article they say that the group is stating that in order for them to delete the stolen information they're requesting four hundred thousand dollars um and they have also threatened to resell the data um to third parties for three hundred thousand that's a lot of money it's a lot of money um yeah but in a statement on may 25th the mayor of augusta um saying that the statement from the media is incorrect he's saying that there was there is no cyber attack um, in the city, even though further down in that article says that the, what did it say? It says that the IT people are determining how much damage has been done. So do y'all believe the mayor? If anybody is in Augusta, Augusta, Georgia, have y'all experienced any kind of technical difficulties? On that date, around that time, 
Have you guys seen anything in y'all news that is related to this? Is the marriage wrong? I mean, maybe the marriage get miscommunication, you know, misinformation on this. What do you guys think about this? Right? Because if they're saying, um, if they're saying after being analyzed that they, these, um, this ransomware group has gotten payroll, physical addresses, and all this information from these individuals and the mayor is saying that it didn't happen, does that mean that they're not going to take accountability for the victims? You know how in the, uh, on the other videos, the, um, the companies will always give like monitoring services, uh, to make, to, for the victims to see that if anything goes on with their account, you know, they'll get alerts on that. So is, is he saying, is he or she saying that's because they don't want to take responsibility for the victims. They don't want to be able to pay out any damages that has been done to the victims. Yeah, I think, so. I don't know. I mean, if it's all over, Maybe he, maybe he just needs to get some more information of how bad it is, right? So, I don't know what, got, what you guys think about this. Again, if you're in Georgia and you have experienced anything of this nature or had any feedback, put them in the comments below. Let's talk about it. Alrighty, so here's another video. Um, I'm going to try to find some more and be posted on a regular basis now. Alright, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!